we have one Aruba Instant On Access Point AP17. It's an outdoor access point. Let's unbox it first. Uh, in the pack, we'll have one access point, one wall mount bracket, one cable gland, and this for the outer proof, out waterproof, and the screws. This is the access point, this is the gland kit and this is the port, uh, this is the RJ45 connector port. So here we can insert the PoE cable for plug it in, uh, for uh, powering it on. So this gland fixes here and the cable enters in this position. Now this is the clamp, this mountable clamp goes to the wall or any other pool or anywhere in your outdoor places and we will fix the access point top on that and there is a screw this is screw goes connection here that's what that's how it goes now we have a PoE connectivity we will connect it we will power it on then we will configure it in usually indoor access points the LED indicator will be on the surface of the access point but in this outdoor we have in the side panel as well as there is no reset button we can found on the access point there is no reset button the reset button has given here inside there there is a USB console port as well as a reset button as well as the LED indicator so to configure it to add it in any network we must have to wait until it is discoverable uh, the, the, this LED status when its status is in green and amber color in alternate way that means it's ready to configure so we'll wait until that now we can see uh, that green color light and the amber color light is blinking in alternating way so now it's discoverable we can add it to our network on the cloud and we can configure Aruba it on cloud portal we'll go for the online devices now it will go for add device we'll check mark this one include over the air outdoor devices and search search for my device here we go it's been detected go for add device check mark it accept it please allow some time for your instant device to be configured okay give it a name uh, we can rename it as a like cafeteria now we have one SSID one network for our employee network which here we have a guest network we want to create a separate network separate SSID which will fit particularly to the outdoor access point only in that case we will create cafeteria there is no VLAN network should be wireless it should be cafeteria Cafeteria and the password we can give one two three four five six seven eight. Okay, so the password is one two three four five six seven eight. Employee network, wireless network, and the network assessment will the main thing. This network we will feed it only for the cafeteria access point. We'll check mark only cafeteria. Just save it so in the, as per this configuration the cafeteria Wi-Fi SSID will only broadcast into the outdoor access point not into the existing access point and even existing network like global gateway Aruba global gateway Aruba this another one as well as the GGIPL guest this wireless network won't be feeding onto the outdoor access point what we have recently configured Go for the device again let's see whether it's up or not it's synchronizing still the moment synchronization is completed 
simple shape. Yeah, it's active. Let's see. Here we go. We have the wireless access point Vinum of cafeteria. We'll connect it. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. It's connected.